Hello everyone, it's me, the from Dr. Bella .com. Um, Today I will be talking about um, why do our Nigerian brothers who are abroad come back home to marry? Um, I know there are so many reasons, like um, there's nothing like our African sisters, you know, white women, they love divorce, you know, and all the whole other excuses, but that's bullshit. You spend your life, you know, mixing with a, 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 a particular race. You stay with them for 10, 8, 7 years, and then you decide they are not worthy to get married to. Then you start telling your parents, uh, please, eh, get us wife at eh, home, preferably virgins. Hmm? You are looking for somebody that you want to come back to Nigeria and frustrate their life. What is wrong with you? Eh? What has race, you know, got to do with intent? This is me fighting for the white ladies out there. You know, they give you their all and all, and at the end of the day, you dump them because they say, you say, not they, you say they are not ready to relocate, they are not ready to invest, you know, and any little thing, they call the police and they report you, and all your years of hard work is over. Why you self no use I enter markets before you go to marry with you, or you go to friend with you? Even our African sisters that you're even dating there, you, you still don't see them as marriageable materials. You say uh, they are not used to the white life. Uh, 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 whenever we do something, they call the cops. Whenever we beat our children, they get angry. Whenever we, you know, misbehave, they call the police, and the police give them our house and, and we start paying child support. Then we, we that we are here in Nigeria, when you beat us, we will not call police, Abi. The fault is sometimes not even with all these, you know, all these uh, Obodo Igbo men. Eh? Our Nigerian girls, in our eyes too, they sharp. He too, they sharp too much. You don't know somebody from Adam. You don't even know what he does in this abroad that he is. He, he comes back home. And I don't marry. Then he tells that, eh, baby, just get pregnant. Eh? Give me one year. Mm -mm 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 come back. I will come back and come and carry you. For one year, you don't get one belly. Two years, two belly. Before you start to uh, know what is wrong, he's telling that uh, baby now, you know our investment in Nigeria, it will not be wise for me to be there and for you to be, you know, here with me, you know, stay there. My sister, you are wife number two. What, are you even wife? His legal wife is abroad, you're just there, uh, you know, baby making machine, you're baby, um, that is what you are. Eh? You, you're there saying, eh, uh, daddy, mom, no, no, abroad. You start making jest of your friends that are not married. So I say, ah, this one. Go single die making the wait for Nigeria, Nigerian man. You're not in Tim abroad. Look, Tim abroad. That's what you are. As in, I am angry. I am angry that you people do not value yourselves. I am angry that somebody out of nowhere, even though he is self made, well made, or not made at all, comes from nowhere and come and pay bright price on your head. And you now want to be a Nigerian wife. You know, you know, those people have an association. Uh, what, what are they even called? Uh, uh, women uh, in Nigeria that are husbands are abroad. They have association. All they know how to do is, you know, their, their, their husbands will send money for them or maybe open a boutique for them, you know. And anytime the man comes back, that is when, you know, he should just open her leg. The man will, you know, put his weapon and, uh, you know, release the weapon inside. And the next nine months, she's occupied with baby number four. Do I blame? Who do I even put this blame on? That's what I don't know. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong, you know, coming back home to marry. But those ones you've been dating, you know, there, who will marry them? Those ones that you promised marriage a very long time ago, who will marry them? You will not come back and be deceiving us. Put the ring on the finger. Tell us to wait for you that you're coming back soon. You will not impregnate us and go back. Oh. Let me, mm, let me not say thunder. Let me not say thunder. Let me just hold this thunder. Let me not send this thunder to strike all those kind of men. Nothing is coming. Nothing is bad to come back home to marry. Hmm? Nothing is bad. But if your sole intention of coming back home to marry is because you don't want to marry on your child, that you've been engaged, that you've used to get paper, that you've used to get visa, who will not marry her? I know some of them, you know, some of you pay for, I know some of them, you know, you pay for these things, I know. But what about the ones that you, that genuinely fall in love with you, that you deceived? Who will not come and marry them? You use her to get work permits. You use her to get residence permits. You use her to get health care. You use her to get the uh, visa. And at the end of the day, you dump her. Or sometimes you will not even dump her. You will have children with her, but you have wife here in Nigeria. 
That one bro home base. You that and that one is a blood base. No, my, my, my brothers, eh? This is a this is very common among our our Igbo brothers. Let, let me just say the truth. I don't see you know, bad people doing all these kind of things. This is very common among our Igbo brothers. You say because uh, in Dutch are like a divorce. What is that supposed to mean? Don't you know how to fight for your marriage? Hmm? See, eh, even this in the self, eh, it's I, I I have to put the blame small on you people. Self, what is wrong with you people? Well, how how, how did it get to this level that you be treating our brothers anyhow? Eh, I, I, they do small thing and you call call the police for them. What is what is what is what is happening in this world? Eh, see, all this abroad man, hmm? leave us alone for our you know, our people here. Hmm? They they've not gone abroad. Leave us for them. You see one small girl, they tell one boy, you know, one, one sugar daddy from nowhere will come and talk to her parents, spray them dollars. The girl will leave her boyfriend for your child. What is wrong? See, I'm not, I'm, I'm not saying it. it it's, I, I, I'm, I'm going to keep saying it. I'm not saying it's bad to genuinely come home. You know, you want to come and marry. But please, when you want to come and marry, know that you're ready to take your wife abroad with you. Don't leave her for the small, small boys in the community to be, you know, those boys are very sharp. Before you know that you say Nigerian women are bad, how will we not be bad? They tell you say continue the whole loss. You will go two years, three years. You be sending mega mega songs. Sometimes this man don't even come back at all. Some of them are even in prison. You don't know. Your parents will bring picture for you to marry. You marry and say say my abroad, say my wife abroad, my husband is abroad. What is wrong with you? You will stay there. You will grow old there. Eh? Before you know that you start again, you know that place you know, on a koga ako. You you, you you want to look for who will help you to maintain and to maintain and oil the engine. Please, not everything that glitters is gold. Hmm? Our Nigerian men will beg me. I am begging you people. Eh? If you don't have good intentions for us, please, 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 do not involve us in your fraud and your scam. We are not interested. Cha cha cha. Please, I am begging you. Eh? Eh? Please, hmm? be cool. Eh? You come home and you tell us you want to marry us, eh, but we have to have baby number one. On baby number one, and you tell us that if I have baby number one, we'll come and meet you there. On baby number one, we're baby number three or number four. Before you know, we are home base. Before you know, you start coming back once a year. Before you know, you start coming back once in four years. Sometimes this, these kids you live here don't even know who you are. They don't know who you, they don't, they have no idea. They, they just have a picture of their father. See that the kind of life for one can they live so. Biko, 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 please, eh? My fellow brothers, please. It is enough. If you want to come back home and marry us, come back home and marry us and take us with you. Don't come back home and marry us and leave us here. We are not commodities. We are not tools. Eh? Don't come and use us and, and, and leave us here for rats to come and be servicing that place. Biko, Biko, Biko. Please, I'll stop for here today. It's, 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 it's something that, when I think about things like this, it begins to get me angry. Eh? Let me stop here. And it is still me, Bella. Mm? My name has not changed. It will not change anytime soon. It's still me, Bella, mm? from talktobella.com. All those people that are sending me emails and saying they don't know the kind of talk. It is talk and letter number two. Mm? And Bella, B-A-L-L-A. It is not hard. Talk eh? and two. Number two. Mm? See the way I'm sweating because of you people. Eh? Talk and two. That's the name of my blog. Eh? If you want this transcript of everything I've said, I've written it down for you people. Mm? Some, some people, they say I have an Igbo accent. I am a Nigerian girl. Pure Igbo. From Abia State. Mm? Anyway, just go to my blog eh? and I'll be visiting it every time. And this is my YouTube channel. Subscribe. And some people are saying open Instagram. I will open very soon. But please, you people should manage this one for now. Eh? Thanks and God bless.